What's up people, it's Osas here with iPhone Hacks and I'm going to be showing you how to set up your brand new iPhone 6S. So the first thing you're going to want to do is of course slide that slider over on the hello screen. You're going to pick your language. I'm going to stick with English because that's the only language I speak. And then you're going to select your region, United States. And then you can choose a Wi-Fi network. Um, you're actually going to want to do this because if you are restoring from iCloud or what have you, you're going to want to make sure that's there. I'm not going to show you guys my password, so we'll skip to the next step. So, with your password logged in, we are going to jump to the next step. It'll take a couple seconds here. Now, you can choose whether or not to enable or disable location services. I'm going to go ahead and enable that because I use maps all the time. Now, we can set up Touch ID. Um, you can also set up it later, but just for showcase purposes I'm gonna actually do it now so all you're gonna have to do is hold your finger there the next step you're gonna adjust your grip so that'll be another option All right, so when that's done, we're gonna hit continue. Now we're gonna create a passcode. You'll notice that there are now six digits instead of the standard four. If you don't like that, you can tap on passcode options and choose from any of these options. I do like the six digits, so I'm gonna stick with that. But for you guys, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, we'll use the code commonly used, that's fine. You're gonna obviously wanna use something better than that but that's what I'm using just to showcase this right now enter that in again and now you can choose whether or not to restore from iCloud iTunes set up as a new phone or move data from Android I'm gonna set it up as a new phone so I'll tap on that option and then I'll enter in my Apple ID information once it has your Apple information entered it'll jump to the iCloud screen where it'll back up your, your um, apps. So you just hit continue. You can read this. If you really want to get into the terms, you can read all of those. We're going to hit agree. Hit agree once more. You can see it's up, updating iCloud settings. You can set up Apple Pay. I am actually not going to do that, so I'm just going to hit next. And then here where it says set up later in wallet, I'll just tap on that. And then of course, to set up your iCloud keychain, you can go ahead and do that or hit don't restore. For now, I'm going to hit don't restore. But if you do approve, approve from another device, that means that it'll send um, a, a little confirmation to either your Mac computer. If you have another iPhone, it'll send it to that and you can confirm this device or you can use the iCloud security code but for right now I'm gonna hit don't restore continue and we can have we can go ahead and set up Siri so let's tap on set up Siri and here are the brief steps hey Siri hey Siri hey Siri so that's hey Siri three times Hey Siri, how's the weather today? Hey Siri, it's me. And now that Siri setup is complete, we're going to hit continue. You can go ahead and if you want to send information to Apple, I would probably rather not, so I'm just going to hit don't send. Uh, now you can choose on the zoom options. I think it looks a little bit funny, so I'll just show you guys that. So this is zoomed. This is standard. Um, I think most people go with standard, but if you like your icons looking a little bit larger, you're going to go ahead and hit that zoomed option. So now we're going to hit next and then get started. And that's the setup for your new iPhone. Um, if you guys have any questions, make sure to leave those in the comment section. And if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. All right, guys. Thanks.